This is a picture of Mrs. Von Eatenberg's 12th grade class. All the students in this class were extremely intelligent and each had their own unique personality. This is Mrs. Von Eatenberg. She is a peace-loving woman. She grew up in the 70s and was very much a part of the hippie revolution and still lives by those beliefs. This is Yumi Yamamoto. Yumi is a foreign exchange student from Japan. He's extremely gifted mainly in art. His specialty is spray paint art. He would create beautiful paintings with just cans of spray paint. This is Elizabeth Spencer. Elizabeth was very much a teacher's pet, mostly towards Mrs. Von Eamberg. Every morning, Elizabeth would get Mrs. Von Eamberg her coffee, run to the copy room to gather her papers for the day, and go to the lounge to get her daily mail. This is Maria Clark. Maria was popular with a lot of people, mostly because of her love for sports. Maria excelled in every sport she tried, and she strived to be the best. This is Helga Spielman. Helga is extremely intelligent. You can always find her either in the library or with her nose buried in a book. Yumi, Elizabeth, Maria, and Helga have had a special friendship ever since starting school. Despite their extreme differences, they've always clicked and have been inseparable for years. And this, this is an empty seat. There were once five members to this class, but not anymore. This seat belonged to Audrey Rose. Audrey was a very confident girl and was good friends with Yumi, Elizabeth, Maria, and Helga. Or so she thought. These four did indeed like Audrey, but her pompous attitude and arrogant demeanor caused the four of them to drift away from Audrey. The story begins with Audrey's 18th birthday. She had invited her four best friends and a few others from school and was anxiously awaiting their arrival. Where are they? I can't believe they didn't come to my party. I'm going to kill them on Monday. <laughs> Hey guys, she didn't even save us any cake. Yeah, I'm so glad we didn't even go. I know, she's like so mean. She told me to read a fashion magazine instead of a real book. Well, she's, she's not a boy. <laughs> oh, she didn't have to be so mean about it. I'm just gonna have to text you and find out where they are. Oh, bye, Rin. It's a text from Audrey. She wants to know where we're at. What should I say? Tell her at the roller disco party. Oh, good idea. Yeah. Send. <laughs> <laughs> She's so stupid. Yeah. A roller disco party? What's wrong with them? This is my 18th birthday party and they couldn't even show up for it. I believe them! Good morning, 
class. How is everyone on a beautiful day like today? Good. Where's Yumi? Uh, we don't know. Oh. Oh. Okay, we're going to learn about the stock market today. Last time I saw him, he was in the arm room. Mm -hmm. What do you think? Do you know where do you think he is now? I don't know. Maybe he's working on an art project. But he can't be. He wouldn't miss class. Okay. Don't forget to do your homework. today. Koga, Yumi, Maria and I, we were outside of Audrey's house and we were laughing at her at her birthday party because nobody showed up. But we didn't want to hurt her, you know, not physically anyway. And then she ran out because she was crying and she ran into the road and a car hit her and we didn't know what to do so we threw her in the woods. Uh, do you know, um, who hit her? Well, we know it's a Subaru. You drive a Subaru. Oh my god, it was you! Guys, Miss Flowers von Eatenberg decided to show up. Thanks for coming to my party. 